Hey guys, this is Matt Beck from freesaloneducation.com here with another quick business tip. And this one is focused on your guest name. Uh, that's one of those things that I am definitely, I would say probably the worst at remembering names. So what we did was we came up with a system in the salon to make sure that we would always know our guest names. Uh, anybody in the salon could walk through and know their name because we created a name card that we put at the station. We set it up for them. If you look at the salon in the back, we basically work our salon like a restaurant. So no one has their own chair. So as people come in, we just rotate the station. So first available station they go to and so on and so forth and they work their way through it. Um, the greatest thing about the name tag, we put it on the station that's ready for the next guest. So when they come in, uh, not only do my stylist know the name of their guest, but as I'm walking through, I can say, hey Ryan, how are you? It's good to see you. Even if I wouldn't have known his name before, me as an owner, I should know their names, obviously. And sometimes when guests don't come to the salon that often, we don't really know their names. So this is a great way to be able to use the guest's name a lot. And the way that I got this idea was um, I was at a clothing store. Um, it was in a mall. It wasn't like a, a crazy fancy store. That's what I liked about it. But when they put me in the dressing room, they put a little dry erase board. They hung it on the dressing room door and it had my name. So they kept coming back saying, hey, Matt, are those pants feeling OK? Does a shirt fit right? And they kept using my name throughout the whole entire visit. And I was like, you know what? That would work in our salon. So we created the name tag here, kind of stole it from a wedding outlook on it. And when we put this in front of our guests, they love it because it shows that that station was prepared ready for them. And so, you know, they really seem to get a lot out of it. And the best way that you can do all of this stuff is to make sure that you keep track of all of your guests' information. And that's really where this tip goes to. Um, make sure that you know everything about your guests from whether they're going on a business trip or they're um, their hair color that you did last time. Um, you know, it's, it's those kind of things that you should take and have them in a computer system. I was in a business class this weekend and most hairdressers that were in that class didn't even have a Facebook page. So we got to make sure that we're keeping up with the times and have in our computer software um, some sort of record of everything that we're doing. There's always a place for it. So look at your computer software um, whatever one you have and just make sure in the description of the guest you can put every bit of information even have them fill out something or just Remember and then after they leave write down some key things that you want to bring up next time Think about if you have a guest sitting in your chair and they say that they're going on vacation Between the, the visits maybe you should write that down in your description And then you can read it right before they come in remind yourself of that exact vacation and then think about what it would mean to your guest if you can bring that up to them later. So it's those kind of things that I think just set people apart in salon business, in any business, is if you can remember those things. So, um, you know, take that tip, use it for yourself, um, you know, and try it out, see what you think. Leave your comments below if you've tried this out before, if you've done anything like this, I'd love to hear about it. And you know, it's one of those things where Millennium's always been a big supporter of mine and they give me all the room and all of the, the uh, options to be able to keep my guests organized and to remember their name and everything else. So, you know, if you don't have a computer software and you're thinking about one, Millennium is the way I would go. And um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. Make sure you check us out, subscribe to us on YouTube and uh, follow us on Facebook and Instagram at freesaloneducation.com and we will see you guys on the next video. Thanks.